basically bought a clown house from some maximalist, but luckily I turned it into a peaceful boho retreat. These crazy floors had to go, so I swapped it for concrete and a simple rug. Threw out this ugly orange chair and got this minimalist one. Wallpaper and art is way too much. I always go for a simple white wall. If you thought that was a lot, wait until you see this hideous kitchen. We had no choice but to demo it and get fully new cabinets, clean, white, and minimalist. Goodbye, busy floors and backsplash, and hello to less is more. Gray and white is such a beautiful combo. Colored cabinets literally should not be a thing. Even in the bedrooms, there's pattern on the floor and the walls. Now I can actually sleep. I don't mind a pop of color, but the previous owners went overboard. How much better is this blue against a white wall versus all of this color? Choosing neutral colors adds resale value to the house. I mean, how much more desirable is it now? Clearly, very few people are going to like an all yellow bedroom, and now it appeals to the masses. Of course, these wacky owners had to express themselves on the outside too, so we trimmed up the yard and cleared it out to put new furniture in. I'm thinking gray and beige.